Hi guys, it's been a while. It's another exciting day for QGIS lovers. QGIS 3.16 Huzurich has been released. In this video, we will learn how to upgrade from 3.16 to 3.18 on a Windows computer. We are actually going to retain our version 3.16 until we are comfortable with the new version. So let's go straight to this exercise. We are going to open our browser. In this case, I'm going to be using Google Chrome. Then in our browser, we're going to just type QGIS, then hit enter. Then I'm going to go to the official website again, QGIS, welcome to QGIS project. I'm going to select that. Then I'll scroll down. You can see they have not actually changed uh, these to 3.18, but when you scroll down here, you'll see there is version 3.18 now currently available for download. If you actually like what these guys are doing with the, with QGIS, you can actually click on the support QGIS and then donate to them. I think they're doing an awesome job. So let's just go directly to downloading it now. So I'm going to click on download now. Then I'm going to scroll down to get the installation version and you can see there is a standalone installer for 3.18 currently now then there's one for 64 bit and there's for 32 bit normally if you want to know if your computer is 64 bit or 32 bit you just come to your browser here on the start menu here and type dxdiag then hit enter and you will be able to access your computer information and you can see my computer is Windows 10 Pro 64-bit so I'm going to install the 64-bit for if you have a 32-bit machine you can just install 32-bit so I'm going to select the standalone installer for 64-bit click on it and I'm going to it is actually 390.79 MB so I'm going to just start download so I'm going to click on start download and the download it takes a little bit of time so i'm just going to forward this video and let's go to the installation step Our download is complete, so let's install our new version and look at the new amazing features. So I'm going to open the folder where I downloaded the installer. And you can see I have version 3.18 here now. So I'm going to right click on the version on the installer. And then I'm going to click on run as administrator. I'm going to say yes. Then you can see this is QGIS 3.18 Zurich. I'm going to click on next. I agree. Then I'm going to install, install it. Install. This is going to take some time, so I'm going to just fast forward this video.
So we are going to click on finish to finish your installation. And we have successfully installed QGIS 3.18 on our Windows computer. So let's run it and look at the new look of QGIS. We're going to access a folder that has been created on our, on our desktop called QGIS 3.18. And we have our installation here. So I'm going to right click on the QGIS desktop 3.18 and open it. And there you have it, QGIS 3.18 has been installed on our computer. We are actually going to look at some of the new features included in this version in another video. Please do subscribe to this channel to get more future updates on QGIS 3.18. See you in the next video.